but we're going to see the Krom regardless. Yeah. I think this is a decent pick. I've, uh, if he, as long as he lands those tech chase situations that he wants, then should be able to get the stock relatively early on Mario. But we'll have to see. This is Gluttony we're talking about, after all. It's true. Starting off on PS2 here. This is Loser's Top 12. This is a hand warmer. No? Mm. No, they're just they're just throwing out moves. Just yeah. cuz. Wow, and Gluttony starting off strong. Already getting two grab combos. And continuing on, actually. He's not done yet. Grabs him into the air. Wow, Gluttony. Gluttony! <laughs> He's... That was a very wow. fast zero to death. That was about, you know... 17 seconds or so. Yeah. Mr. R didn't even get to play the game yet. <laughs> and he didn't even start the combo for who knows Lao Oh, long. no way. No way. He's actually dead. Oh, he's not. Oh. He is? He is dead. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Gluto, 1.2%, three stocks to Mr. R's 0% one stock. Yeah, Mr. <gasps> okay. okay. That time, yeah. Mr. R was able to navigate around. He's like, okay, I've seen the trick once. Let's try it again. <laughs> I, I, oh I, I don't know if. I dead? think he used his jump. No, Never mind. Okay, okay. I thought he used the jump as soon as he came back on. All right, anyways. Very high octane matches from Gluto. Yeah, not, now so that far. we have an actual match going on, yeah. instead of uh, Gluttony uh, practicing in training mode for a bit. Mr. R finally getting his turn to speak. He's got the stage control. Oh, he picks up the bike. I don't think he wanted that. Yeah, he probably just got messed up there. Maybe thought he wanted to. <gasps> I can't believe he did that, but that was his first stock. Okay, well, I mean, Gluttony has a lot of uh, a lot of room to mess up like that. So he, yeah, I, guess, I guess he was thinking, he's like, oh, why not? Let's go for another edge guard, see what it works. Yeah, he's pretty much almost taken this last stock, and there's a waft attempt not going to work, but the up smash off of the parry, that is going to work, and Gluto is going to take game one with an emphatic finish. Dude, when, when it freeze frames into the gigantic Wario head, that's like that image is just burned into my mind. Is it? Into my retina yeah, for yeah. the rest of the match. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> they keep the uh, yeah. Gloony with a little smirk, like, heh, I Take, did that to him. We got some screenshots of that. Yeah. Alrighty. Very strong response from Gloony. He just didn't let Mr. R play his game, which is, you know, space out with an aerial, and then maybe trying to go in with a conversion afterwards. Gloony just said, nope, we're starting the game. You are dead. Here we go. Yeah, and that's really what Wario needs to do, is he needs to get on top of the opponent. Because all of his hitboxes are so stubby, yeah. which is what he's got to do. And so, Lucho really showed this is how you do it. Oh, yeah, despite that really shaky first game, he's still going to stick with Krom, so. And I think that, that I think goes. that's a good decision. I, I don't want to say that last match was a fluke, but I think that Mr. R has learned sufficiently enough about Gluto and how he's going to try to play this matchup that he can make an adaptation and fix it. All right, now we got actual neutral now, not just Gluttony <laughs> pressing the A button on him a lot. Never mind. Yeah, Still pressing know. the A button. This is just Wario, man. Yeah. Wario, once he gets that one hit, he takes it all the way to 60%. And Gluto has optimized all of those, you know, combo trees so well that he gets one hit, he knows exactly what he's going to do for the rest of the combo. Yeah, I really like the, the patience and just the way he's facing. Usually he's able to get something out of shield very quickly. Oh! All right. He racked up 100% and then really just died at 8. Hey man, sometimes that's how it works. <laughs> Risk reward, am I right? Yeah, I mean, sometimes. But I, at the same time, I think you need to challenge that Krama B from below it instead. That's what yeah. we saw Light do really, really well against Mr. R. Mm -hmm. And he would up smash every time that Mr. R didn't up B. Right. I try to find that forward though. Not quite gonna find it. Mr. R with an opportunity here. Gets that dash attack. Still got the control. Yeah, to find a forward tone, since quite. that up B, Mr. R has kind of taken over this game. He hasn't let Gluto speak back at all. Yeah. All right, now that he has a big lead, he doesn't really have to commit as hard like when he spaces. So he can try and force Gluttony with his stubby arms, like you said, to try and find something. Yeah, and the WAP is online. Gluto probably going to save him for later. There's the forward air off stage. Yeah, great edge guard. Knew that Krom was trying to position himself for an ether. Didn't quite work out. Yeah, and Wario, one of the better characters at getting out there and hitting characters like Krom just because of his amazing aerial mobility, and that's what helps him get combos just like that. Yeah. Looks like he might be saving the WAF for maybe the last stock instead. He yeah. might try. Ooh, ooh, I was going to say he might try to even it up right now, but now that he's lost that second stock. Yeah, Probably. Black wasn't available, so he couldn't come back. He was already stuck on the stage. Right, full waft, now charged. Mr. R, he's kind of just been all over Pluto ever since that 1-up beat. Oh! oh, 
Yeah, he didn't get the strong hitbox of it. He gets the combos, not combos, but he gets a string into the, uh, the back air anyways. Mr. R, there's a bite. Yeah, still keeping out the ledge control. He That's what I want to see. That's what I, I want to see him challenge that with up smash instead. Yeah. Almost had it. I know that Fox up smash is very good at it, like very consistent at punishing it. I'm not so sure about Wario's up smash, but at least the idea is there as well. There's a dash attack and it even up the stock count. Gluto, 63%. That's one Wario combo. Mm -hmm. However, the, I, it, it's interesting because he already used up his last. So maybe if he, if he can get a kill with like a small one, then it, it can definitely change the, the tide of the match. We'll have to see. Uh-oh. The anti-air. I don't think he has a jump. Yeah, I can have to air dodge back down. Give me a forward throw. Mr. R not able to get anything off of it. Wow, Gloomy really brought it back after all that. Uh-oh. That was an yeah. attempted F smash. Yeah. I don't know if he... He, he might have just wanted another forward tilt and then accidentally smash stick it. Yeah, if it, was, if it was on purpose, that was ambitious. Yeah. Mr. R is hunting for this last knock. All he needs is like a strong forward tilt. Jab back air. There yep. it is. He's waiting for it, man. There's something unsafe on shield, and then Mr. R can just go in with that. 1-1, one, one, Mr. R picking up that last game. All things considered, Luto played really, really well, but it, feel, it felt like after that first stock that he lost, he got flustered or something. Yeah, it's like he lost control of how the pace of the match should have gone. Absolutely. So Mr. R was able to play at his tempo better that first time. The first the first match, Gluttony was overwhelming Mr. R, so Mr. R was playing catch-up the whole time. But right. as soon as Gluttony lost his lead, I think the game plan kind of fell apart. All right, Gluto, he's thinking. He, he really just has that thinking face when he puts his hand on his chin like that. Yeah, it's good to meditate. Like, you, you got to think before going to the next match. You got to make sure your emotions aren't <laughs> getting in the way of what's going on in, yeah. in, in, I, in the set. I even encourage people to do that mid-match. When they get, when they lose the stock, you know, you're sitting on the angel platform, just chill there, you got time. Think about what's going on. Okay, I like that. Yeah, as soon as Mr. Ari gets a grab, he's able to convert off of it as well, okay? Cities into Ether, gonna have to land on the platform or something. Mr. R, you saw that little positioning that he could cover either landing on the platform or landing in front of him. This isn't quite executed properly at the end. Yeah, Mr. R has shown that he is very proficient with these Chrom combos, especially the ones in the upbeat. Luto. He's pressuring Mr. R. Mr. R takes stage back, but instantly loses it. Bike setup? There's the up throw. Bike setup. Looking forward again. Ooh, just gonna clank. Not able to get anything there, but Gluto is keeping Mr. R in the corner, and that's what's important. There's the back end. Okay. I really like the idea that he did it early. Maybe would have caught Gluttony trying to edge guard a bit too soon, and then he would have landed on the platform, but just uh, not quite there. Gluttony one step ahead. Oh, ooh. Bike at hitbox was still active after that jab, too. Yeah, that was uh, interesting. Maybe he didn't even want that, though, because uh, jab into back air would have probably worked better. Yeah, absolutely. Like, he probably got in the way. He Luto. just grabbed him right out of dash back. Yeah. <laughs> Luto has been hanging on to this stock for dear life, trying to get anything going, but Mr. R has not let that happen. Still 0%, two stocks on each of them. The Harley Davidson there. <laughs> Luto, he just needs this one opening. Krom on Town and City. Is I'm surprised that Gluto took him here. Prom loves Town and City. Right. Combo extensions go so far with Prom here. Trying to find the extension. Okay, got the anti air. Yeah, uh, Prom has a lot of room to try and land. Ooh, tech chase into yeah. forward smash. Yeah, very nice stuff from uh, Mr. R. He rarely drops those, especially at the ledge. I mean, Mr. R's ledge trapping game has always been really good, so he can usually tell what you're trying to do when you're in a bad uh, scenario like that at the ledge. Mr. R has been playing immaculately so far. Game three, Gluto hasn't really been able to get as many combos. He hasn't been able to get so many setups to get kills. Mr. R has just been playing great defense. Yeah. Full waft is available though, so that's the wild card we always got to consider uh, when considering any match. No tech chase again, or tech chase again into the down smash. Yeah, Gluto definitely saving this waft for the last. Uh oh. He's going in for that down air each time. Hasn't worked out yet, but when it does, you never know. All right, throws out the bike. Mr. R is faster on the ground. Going to be able to get a pivot on that. 
Puto he, he, he retook stage for that fair right there. That was super, super good. He reacted to Mr. R kind of jumping in the air with him, and he gets the back air. And now, full waft is online. 132%. Wario, Wario, this is scary. Oh, he didn't do he it the back air that time. Yeah, yeah, he missed it. A bike actually could kill. He gets a bike kill. Like a strong hit of a bike throw. Oh, yeah. That could do it. And there's the up tilt. All right, that's enough to do it. Okay, Mr. R going up 2-1 against Gluttony. Based so, on game one, that you would not have expected this result. Yeah, definitely. I think Mr. R, though, he's a very seasoned player, so being able to keep his calm and reassess the situation after a big big game like that for his opponent, I think he's probably one of the best ones at that. Yeah, he's adapted very well. And I just have to say, I really like this Beast Coast like baseball jersey. That is sick. I got to get me one of those. Game four, we are going back to Town and City. And it looks like a hand over again. Yeah, again. Maybe, that, maybe, that's, maybe that's a sign that Gluto is going to do well again. We'll have to see. There's the start of the combo. Oh my gosh. Oh, you had the right idea with that bite. Not quite able to connect to it properly. Okay. Just grab. Yeah. Not able to get enough air out of it. Waiting for the up B. Double, double up tilt. Up tilt. Almost got double up air after, too. Mr. R hasn't really been able to get his combos going, and now the platforms are gone. That's no bueno. I really respect that Gluttony keeps trying to challenge it, but he's just not finding the right option. I don't know if he just can't figure it out or if he's just executing it. So it's got to be one of those two things. Yeah. I think if he gets there early enough with the down air, it'll work out, but it hasn't so far. Yeah. Oh, he's now. got an opportunity. Yes. That's what he was looking for. Yeah. yeah. Because uh, he doesn't bring his sword up with him. He, or like... Um, it doesn't start hitting at the yeah, top yeah, until yeah, he's yeah. at the apex. Right. It's not like Ike's. Oh, another combo. No, not able to extend after the up air. Okay, catching him shielding after that combo. Mr. R got a little bit of catching up to do here. Yeah, and he, he's got an opportunity here. If he gets a jab into a back air at the right part of the stage, then he might get something. That's a waft. That's an early stock. Bluto looking great game four. That's exactly what he needed. He didn't land any WAF kills like the last two games that he was playing. So that's something that he really needs. That's, I mean, that's obviously Wario's win condition. He's got to get at least one stock with that. Absolutely. And there's the jab into the back air. Mr. R going to take that first stock finally, but he's got some work to do. Oh. Yeah, he really wants to do bite off stage. Probably send him in a really bad angle. Just carry him down and then maybe just throw him off. Maybe catch him with the down air afterwards. This ledge trapping from Mr. R has been immaculate. Pluto has not really been able to answer back until just now. All right. A little bit of a panic up B, trying to get out of that scenario. Wow, that bike combo as it was coming back, too. Pluto has been playing defense really, really well. He's been getting off the ledge really well, except for you know the beginning of this stock. Mr. R just hasn't really been able to trace his movement off stage. <laughs> I mean, Wario is kind of a slippery character, especially in the air, too, so sometimes it's difficult. Okay. That's no jump. Uh, up air, or down, look, yeah, looking for the down air again. He wasn't there in time, though. Yeah, that time uh, got a little bit stuck on the way down. Mr. R is one interaction away from taking this stock, though, so if he gets that, then maybe two more interactions. To <laughs> yeah, maybe two. I was going back there, not quite doing the job yet. A lot of rolling for Mr. R, maybe getting a little bit flustered, picks up the bike. I mean, it's a scary situation to be in. <laughs> Last yeah. stock against a, a Wario, and he's probably going to have like he's got it, a, yeah. a medium-sized waft afterwards. Yeah. He just got it, actually. If Mr. R somehow brings this back, I'll be very... Okay, parry, Ooh. not quite enough. If he somehow brings this back. Yeah, he finally was able to poke through and get to Pluto, but... Still, this is this is rough. He's got to get something going, but he's got the optimal platform set up for his combos. All right, that's speaking of optimal, already got 30% off of that. This is a big walk. Yeah, he he's a very high percent, so I feel like uh, Gluttony actually lost a lot of setups. He might have to do like a tech chase read instead. Or yeah, he could do parry or even just a, if he shields something that's really unsafe, or if Mr. R just up smashes. I think he could have just wafted there and he would have died, but the back here not going to do it. He probably thought it was going to kill. It didn't quite work. Oh, gets right around it. Oh my gosh! All of a sudden, we got himself a match. Uh oh. Oh, the moving platform probably wasn't confident in the ability of the waft to come out and kill, but the down air is going to do it. Luto evens this set up 2-2.
Man, you really wouldn't expect that dare to just hit so hard. It looks like it should just like send you nowhere. Yeah. Like a fox drill or something like that. Exactly. But it like yeah, sends yeah. you flying off stage. Glutiny really made some changes going from game three to game four there. He was able to get all of his combos. He was winning neutral a lot more. And Mr. R just seemed a little bit flustered, wasn't really ready to, you know, deal with Gluto's safe poking tools on his shield. His out of shield options just were not connecting. Right. All right, we got a small version now, this time Smashville. I'm a little bit worried about this one. Maybe Krom needs a little bit more room to make things work, but we'll have to see. Yeah, both of these two playing very careful. But then here we go, Gluten strikes first blood. Man, I don't know what it is. It's just, he's not quite landing the, the bite like he did in game one. He got like three of them in a row, but this time yeah. around. Mr. Like R definitely like seems to be looking for it now. Yeah. And I think if he didn't directional air dodge there, that was going to be A-OK -okay for him. But because he directional air dodged after the up B, Pluto got hit a whole bunch more. Tech chasing the platform. Not able to get a third. Back throw. Maybe try to catch a DI trap first, but wasn't confident in the option there. Council dash track not connecting. Mr. R. He's got like the stage control. Back. This is huge. If you've got a Wario above you like that, it's hard for Wario to get back. But this Pluto just kind of finds his way back in. Right, he's not even challenging. Yeah, he's not yeah. even challenging <laughs> anymore. And that dash attack is gonna do it. Yeah. Mitsara got a little bit of catching up to do. May not be able to seal the deal quite yet. Yeah, he's got the control on the platform. But for how long? Ah! Oh, he had it. Yeah, he had it too. He didn't trust himself. I yeah, I got, he didn't have faith. He didn't believe, man. Pluto playing catch with himself, just throwing his ball around the yard. Oh my gosh, wow. this bike. The item play from Gluto has been great. Yeah, he's just getting tossed left and right right now. Uh-oh. Oh, he side, he meant to down the... Yeah. Definitely. He was looking for where it at. Mm -hmm. Might have tried to be reverse it or something to get oh. the right positioning and just accidentally side beat and the bike was still in respawn mode. Yeah. He just got blown up for free there. And then he just used his waft right there. Thought that he was going to get it off of the up tilt, but did not connect. Yeah. yeah I, he got the up tilt, I understand it, but sometimes it's like one of those things where you didn't quite land it the first time, so you're kind of stubborn and you want to do it again. So maybe, maybe Gluttony thought he could catch him off guard, but it didn't quite work out the way he wanted to. Mr. R, stock is gone. Pluto up one. This is game five. This is do or die for Mr. R. Yes. Pluto, he's got more gas in the tank. The combos have been nasty, but he hasn't really been able to get a huge extension like we've seen past games. Right. Uh oh. Mr. R off stage, able to avoid the bite. Good tech in, avoids yep. the dash tag. He doesn't have the waft available, so he couldn't get the kill off that, but still got a lot of damage. Oh, he waited. I think he could have gotten the back there. Yeah. That might have been what he was looking for. Uh, maybe he didn't expect uh, Mr. Hard to drift that far. Gluto, he is in solid control, and the slap gonna take game five for Glutoni. All right, manages to clutch it out. Yep. Mr. R finishing off in ninth place today. Very nice stuff uh, from both players.